Being part of FPQC has been one of the most rewarding experiences in my professional career. Our Perinatal Quality Collaborative's mission, it's noble. It's to improve the health of mothers and infants in Florida by helping our hospitals and healthcare providers to focus on quality and patient safety. I went into medicine to help people and day to day I get to do that. But with my involvement with FPQC, I've been able to help women in particular and their infants in a more global way. I was part of the original group that was trying to pull together in support of Dr. Seppenfield's big visionary idea that we needed a perinatal quality collaborative in Florida. But it supported what we were trying to accomplish at the March of Dimes as well. And we had the need to address some state level issues that we didn't have the capacity to measure. So the founding of the Perinatal Quality Collaborative gave us the capacity to look at data in our state in a way that we had not been able to do before, and then to address those problems in a very scientific way at the hospital level. Being involved with FPQC from the very beginning has been a great time for us as nurses. We are able to collaborate with different hospitals across the state, which we never were able to do before. So it's given us an opportunity to find best practices across all of the hospitals in Florida. I think one thing that FPQC has really been successful is raising the awareness of the importance of quality improvement and also data-driven practice. Beyond improving Florida C-section rates, our response to obstetric hemorrhage, our utilization of mother's own milk or the care of mothers and infants that are being impacted by opioid use disorder, I actually think that our greatest benefit to the state has been the use of these initiatives as a mechanism to increase the quality improvement capacity and capability of our own healthcare providers as they attempt to tackle their own local healthcare problems. Right now, if you look at the FPQC, we're recognized as one of the strongest perinatal quality collaboratives in the country. I think that within the next 10 years, using what we've learned, we will only continue to grow. Seeing the results that FPQC has had, I think has just piqued interest. So I think there's going to be a high demand for participation that's really going to raise the bar on services for women and children and outcomes. I continue to be amazed and proud when I think of all of our accomplishments and what FPQC has meant to providers around the state. Even when I'm not at an FPQC sanctioned event, I meet people who tell me what a difference that we've made. It is extremely rewarding and it's what contributes to me feeling like I make a difference every single day. I'd like to say happy anniversary to the FPQC from the Florida Department of Health. We are looking forward to the next 10 years working with you and partnering to make a difference in the lives of moms and babies across Florida. Thanks for all you do. Happy birthday, FPQC. Happy birthday, FPQC. Happy birthday, FPQC. Happy birthday, FPQC. Happy birthday, FPQC.